Hey everybody, it's Tammy the Pink Survivor. So welcome to one of my fun little food videos today. I'm just gonna have a little dinner party and I just wanted to show you a, a few cute ideas that I found. One was just using things that you have around the house. I just grabbed this you know, tray, put it with this little runner on top of a tablecloth. You can put either fake or fresh lemons and then maybe get some fresh flowers. It just really makes a difference and I think it really brightens up the table. And then also, I just learned how to make these adorable um, little like flower roses out of your cloth napkins. So I'm gonna show you exactly how easy this was to do. So what you're going to do is you're going to take your cloth napkin and fold it like this into a triangle. Then next, you're going to take the long side and just keep rolling it. Keep going. To about right here, so you can see that. Then you're gonna come to one of the ends and now you're gonna start rolling it this way. You're gonna take this little end here and you're gonna tuck it in. Next, you're going to pull down the top here, turn it over, and then you can kind of just push that through a bit. And there you go. So here's a really fun way to dress up your charcuterie board, which I've been loving to make for just like a little appetizer, or you can do it as a whole dinner presentation. So I'm gonna show you how to make these little either salami or pepperoni roses or flowers. You're just gonna take a glass and you're gonna fold your, your meat over the side like this. So this glass will take about three. Just kind of pinch them down there so they kind of stay. Then overlap it a bit. If they're a little on the thinner side, they'll work better than if they're really thick. So we'll get a little bit more in here because you'll see that you'll be able to press those down a little bit easier. Let's see if we can get one more here. This one. And then you're just gonna turn it over, place it on your charcuterie board, maybe put some cheeses around it and olives, and it just really makes a beautiful presentation. So I went ahead now and I've added some grapes and also some white cheddar right here on this like fancy little cheese board. And I'm gonna show you, um, this is called Manchego cheese and it's in a triangle. So I just wanted to show you kind of a fun fancy way that you can set it up. You're gonna have your triangles and you're just gonna go back and forth. There, hopefully you can see that. And just, I'm gonna pick it up here in just a second. We're gonna see how pretty this looks. See here, I'm just gonna turn it over. Isn't that cool? So just kind of falls into this little like kind of pattern. So that's really pretty. And I'm gonna show you something that you can do with salami. But, and then with the apples, I just kind of slice them thin and I'm just gonna go ahead and kind of, you know, just kind of place stuff around. And it's kind of fun because you don't, there's no like right or wrong way to do this. You kind of just get all your little slices of apples in there good with the cheese and you can get like a, a apple with some cheese and some of this fig butter is delicious. Okay, I'll show you some more in just a bit. 